Jane, congratulations. Such an Thank honor. You. <laughs> you look absolutely amazing. I, I want to ask you, this, this award means so much, and you have done so much. If your father were here, what would he say if he were here to see you win this award? Well, he'd be very proud of me. He won this award. Mm -hmm. And he'd, uh, I think so. I believe so. Um, he'd be very proud of me. But I feel he is here. I can feel his spirit. Uh, the next question goes to Matt uh, Donnelly Variety. Hi, Jane. Congratulations. Hi, Jane. An incredible, inspiring speech. Um, given your incredible life and career, I just wonder if you could go back and relive one day, what would it be? What would it be? I don't want to go back and live one day. I, I, I can't. I can't think of any day I'd want to go back and relive. I'm very happy with the present. I'm sorry, I can't give you an answer. Uh, next question will ask uh, uh, E. Erin Lim. It's very hard to understand. Hi, Jane. Can you hear me? Uh, yes. First of all, congratulations. Yes. You are an icon. I bow down to you. And I just want to know, has there ever been a role that you didn't get to play? And if so, what is the role that you wish you could take on? I can't think of any. I, I, I did play Nora in a doll's house. I'd like to do that again, but I'm too old. Okay, we come to the last question it's from People Magazine, Topher Scott Roger. Hi, Jane. I just want to know how are you planning to celebrate this amazing, iconic win? Well, I am. I'm. I know where I'm going to put this already, and uh, I'm going to go home, and then I'm going to go right to bed because I have to get up very early in the morning. So. Nothing too exciting, but this is excitement enough. <laughs>